Yeah. Mm-hmm. Sorry. You know, Hi. I gotta mug it up. <laughs> Welcome to the Creedence Guild podcast number. <laughs> <laughs> so we're doing some little something special. It's if you can't secret, tell, because we can't count. It, well, not above ten. I need to take off my shoes for that. No, I can go into negative integers though. Easily. Negative is easy. You know. Yeah, pessimism's pretty natural to understand. Anyway, uh. <laughs> what what's going on tonight? This is not a normal podcast. We are, you know, we start off as a gaming podcast, mm-hmm. and then we only play like three games. <laughs> <laughs> so tonight, obviously, Jay's not well, with like, us tonight. Well, like of what stripe? We're talking about like board or video games because we talk about video games like all the time. Yeah, but. Board gaming is kind of rare for all of us, or each of us, because we don't have the time anymore. Well, yeah, but we, we're we continuing that trend that we don't follow so often. Right. Mm-hmm. And uh, what you are here, if you're listening to us, uh, if you're listening to this podcast, what I'm going to suggest is you go ahead and shut it off. <laughs> because we already have your download, so thank you so much. For which reasons, Bob? <laughs> well, because we want you to watch what we're doing tonight. Tonight uh-huh. we are going to play a card game. And what are we playing, Corey? It's Transformers, the trading card game. The trading card game. Which All is right. one of my new stupid obsessions. Uh, I, go- <laughs> I somehow inflicted this upon you. I, I have no idea how, how I did that. You know what? I We went to Megacon last that's, year. That's right. You picked up the starter. And yeah, okay. you said you should get that. I got that, and uh-huh. it just sat on my shelf for the next 10 months. <laughs> that's, it's, that's right. That's right. I saw that the other day, and I was like, open that fucking door. Open it. Yeah. Open it. Yeah. Mean, meanwhile, you've been playing like crazy. Uh-huh. And if you want to watch us play, you want to go to our YouTube channel. There's going to be a link... Uh, mm-hmm. below in the description of this podcast yeah. if you want to watch us play. Yeah. and Or just go to our Twitter page at Cretans Guild and you'll be able to watch it. But if you just want to listen, that's fine because we're going to describe everything we're doing as mm-hmm. best as we can. We are still new to this game, but this is a very uh, interesting game, especially if you're a big fan of Transformers. Mm-hmm. This is my third time playing or TCGs as a whole, you know. But I, I, I'm gathering that if you know about TCGs anyway, you probably heard about it. Right. Yeah. But there is a particular way of starting off, so... And I'm still learning, even though I've played a couple of times and beaten him both times. Yeah. Once was a technicality. Obviously, I'm still learning, too. <laughs> <laughs> How not to be a fucking punching bag. Um, so let's just get right into it. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And let's talk about... What we're starting off with. Corey, what are these big cards that we have in front of us? These are our character cards. These are the stars of the show. Bots. Yes. And uh, I didn't intentionally mean to describe them as stars of the show. Because that's uh, foundational to how you pick your characters and how you set your teams up. No, no, I got you. Yeah. I mean, uh, Cup isn't a star, but he's in here somewhere. Well, we have stars on the bottom of each card. Yep. And and according to... um, the advanced rules of the game. You could technically play this game from out of the box with just a starter set, which includes... Which is most of what I have. Which is most of what you had, yeah. And you bought a couple of boosters when we were at MegaCon as well. Yep. Um, but even in the starter set, you have four bots, so you can divvy those up to two per player, and then you can just, like, draw for uh, draw for the attack phase, and then that's it. Not use the booster, not use the battle cards for any of their uh, supplementary abilities or anything. Just attack, attack, defend, defend. Um, it's a very shallow game when you do it like that. So, advanced rules are where we're at. All right. So, just for like, uh, like beginner style, whatever. Uh huh. So, we're, we're starting with three each, and mm-hmm. that's just by coincidence, but there is a particular rule that you have to apply by in order to start off with, and your, uh, your cards, mm-hmm. the character cards cannot exceed, is it 25 stars? 25 star rating, yeah. Okay, I am playing with Optimus Prime, Dinobot Swoop, mm-hmm. and Starscream. And you know what kills me about this? Go ahead. Go okay, ahead I was going to point out that yeah. uh, the total for my stars are 5, 10, 15, 20, <laughs> 20, I have 23 stars 23 between stars the three total. of them. Okay, now first of all, I anticipate you pounding the living sh- out of me because I'm kind of playing with a joke team tonight. Who do you have? I have uh, Flame War, RC. Who? And Cup. Who's that first one? Flame War. Flame War is my girl. She's not a joke. I've I just never heard her of Flame team. War. Um, she, she was actually the first booster I ever pulled, and uh, I played her in like a uh, in like a remote hand against somebody, and uh, I was like, you know, I still fucking lost. But she kicks ass. All right. I don't know what I don't know what um I don't know what timeline she's from either though. 
So I'm going to be guessing that it's from after the 2000s when they started getting a little bit fast and loose with all of our bots. I can tell you, I've watched the first three seasons of Transformers and mm-hmm. the movie like a hundred times. Flame War is not ringing any bells with me. Yeah. So I'm going to, well, at some point I'm going to do some research on where she came from. We all know Cup because his first appearance was in the, the movie. movie. Yeah. Yep. And honestly, the first time I used Cup with you, I was like just dragging him down the entire, through the entire You were bad mouthing him. I was him. just bashing Sergeant Cup. And then I saw the movie and I'm like, <coughs> this guy's kind of a hard ass. I'm going yeah. to have him back on my team. See if we can do something with him. Yeah. So each character has uh, an attack. Yeah. A defensive level and a health level, and that can change whether they are in uh, alt mode or alt mode. rope or, or uh, bot mode. Bot, well, yeah, because the cards flip over, mm-hmm. and in some cases the numbers do change. Yep. And the one thing I like here is most of I think everyone we're using except for Cup there mm-hmm. has some terminology. That comes into play as you're using it, depending on what mode you're using. Yep. Cup is flavorless. He has nothing to say. Cup is just a soldier. He's yep. nothing special about him. Yeah, he's just a some sort of a bastard-ass utility truck. That, I'll give this one, this version of him, looks way better than the movie version does. Yeah, well, yeah, he always... The like, toy looked great. The comic looked yeah. okay. Well, I wasn't super high on the on the toy design either because those three bots were all like Cybertronian vehicle designs, right? I was thinking, it was like, is he supposed to be like a futuristic El Camino? I thought he was just like a slipper. <laughs> <laughs> That's real. <laughs> if we're gonna, if we're gonna, like, you know, pick nits. Um, yeah, it, some of these characters they also have uh, secondary designations, like mm-hmm. Optimus is a leader, a yep. truck, and a range fighter. Yep. Swoop is a Dinobot and a specialist, mm-hmm. and Starscream is a leader, plane, and range. What are your special? Um, well, we got truck, motorcycle, motorcycle. What, whoever, I guess if you're a girl in the Transformers universe, you're either a motorcycle or a plane. You're a robot with tits. It's kind of blue. <laughs> <laughs> boobers of dubious function the whole idea of gender in uh in transformers is kind of like a weird thing to me anyway yeah because of robots i don't like i mean there are there are dudes that are really into like muscle cars that will refer to them as she has to get an oil change etc cetera, etc cetera. <laughs> but i've never like i've never like walked up to my toast and be like how you doing baby you want to heat up this yeah, bread? Why is it? <laughs> why is it that Transformers, the female, or sup- uh, like supposed female, yeah, the ones that have very feministic qualities, yeah, have like these uh, chest plates that extend out and back in? It's like, oh, those are her boobs. Okay, yeah. Why is it none of the guys have like giant cod pieces? Well, I uh, aside from Megatron, I do <laughs> the, toy, the toy version of Megatron has the trigger right there. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, I was gonna say it's like, well, he wears his codpiece on his forearm. I yeah, guess. I don't know. <laughs> There's all the phallic symbology you'll need with that one. I mean, he turns into a freaking gun, <laughs> or used to, used to, right? Um, with Optimus, the Optimus, the the the, the like the humanistic physiognomy is kind of physiognomy is pretty easy to draw parallels to because he has pecs. And the windshields are the the windshields are those basically. <laughs> yeah. Um. And like you pointed out with Megatron, uh, he wears his assumed gender. I guess pretty. <laughs> <laughs> he's pretty out and proud about it. <laughs> he's a tyrant, and it makes him. You know, he gets him to where he needs to be. Um, Pull my trigger, Star Scream. But then there are some other like feminine looking male Transformers, such as Prowl from the animated series, who really? was supposed to be. Yeah, well, he's he's very slim, and he's supposed to be the agile, you know, like the the rogue style uh, okay. transformer. But he spoke with a male voice, obviously. Um, and there's no such thing as like you know uh, a female to male body type crossover that we've seen thus far either. So they're sticking to like just they're sticking to pretty conventional type for the most part, as far as female transformers are concerned. Uh, but the male body types can seem to run the gamut. <laughs> this sounds like a philosophical debate that's going beyond the card play See, here. because you're making me think about this, and then I'm starting to to consider, like, the political genesis of the whole Cybertronian war to begin with. All right. And if we're actually <laughs> rooting for the bad guys this entire time with the Autobots, because what caused this whole this whole philosophical rift to begin with? Where, where, where did this political uprising begin? And, oh, oh, and here's a good one. It's just two. It's just two schisms fighting against each other, right? Mm-hmm. Who used to be the figures of authority 
And who used to be the rebels? It depends on the source. The most common one I've seen, mm -hmm. and we'll get to the game eventually. <laughs> the most common thing I've seen is the Decepticons, Megatron more so, uh -huh. wanted control of all the Cybertron. So he started propaganding mm -hmm. uh, all Decepticons. Because at that time, Decepticons outnumbered Autobots like yeah. six to four. Come like, really? Something like that. No yeah. Shit. And then he started propagating that the Autobots attacked us, so we need to get them before they kill all of us innocents, innocent Decepticons. Okay. And so he just started like a flame war, and that blew up kind of like Fox News does. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> so he got all his make Cybertron great again <laughs> hats <laughs> and all the other Decepticons because they're not the smartest bunch. You're like, yeah, okay, let's listen to this guy. <laughs> so there's a lot of real-life uh, political parallels. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's not even speaking contemporarily, that's just how propaganda works. But, um, but okay, but then that's, that raises the question, and this will be the last time I bring this up. Who was the ruling class to begin with? Was it the Decepticons or the Autobots? Well, how far back are we going? Because Way the fuck back! I want to know the what The I The who? The, well, yeah. <laughs> um, I don't know this. Again, depending on the source you look at, there was Primus and then there was Unicron. Oh, sorry about that. Um, I that's right. Okay, okay. I, I know you're, I know you're talking about. Um, this is basically the genesis of the whole Prime thing, right? A little bit, yes. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Because but, Primus formed himself into a planet, and Unicron felt, formed himself into a planet. Yeah. And Primus eventually became dormant, but his body became Cybertron. Cybertron right. Okay. And before he became dormant, he expelled twelve. Transformers, who became the original Primes. Okay, all right. So, I, see, w when I was reading about this, I uh, I kind of likened it to the old uh, the old uh, Greek mythology structure where there was uh, very much there was Cronus and then the Titans. Uh, I'm sorry, there was the Titans first and then Cronus. Cronus threw all the Titans into Tartarus, and then yep. afterwards, Cronus just started you know boning everything, and then <laughs> then his horny children started boning everything else too, and now we're. Uh, Basically, the product of just a lot of incest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Even down to the cellular cellular level, we're related. According to the Greeks. Brothers. What's up? <laughs> All right. Which means you all married to your sisters <laughs> or cousins. Alabama doesn't care. No, <laughs> they're just like. He's like so. You mean biblically or? <laughs> <laughs> Alabama's like. In, and and <laughs> in, all, in all definitions, I know it's not shocking to y'all, and I and I no. and I'm jealous, kind of. But anyway, okay, right. So starting mm -hmm. off this game, uh, mm -hmm. you have to start off your characters. If you're able to manage four mm -hmm. uh, characters, I totally could have brought in a fourth. Looking at this team, well, how how many points do you have? Seventeen. Seventeen. You might be able to work in one more. Yeah, but I, I didn't bring any more anyone, anyone you, else. You're Besides, gonna, you're gonna stick with what well, you got. It's only gonna be two girls, one cup. Okay. Because if it's oh my god, did you just now get that? I just now got that. Really? Yes. E even after I tweeted this, like three days ago, I must have missed it. <laughs> oh, shit. Despite everything Twitter throws at you, hey, you, <laughs> did you see this? We saved this for you to see. He's like, okay, whatever. That's, that's why I always turn up top tweets, because you don't get the best tweets, such as my terrible visual gag with this Transformers team. <laughs> that's yeah, perfect. Two girls, one cup. That's why I Oh my put them God, together. that's so perfect. Yeah. Okay. So starting off play, all your robots have to be in their alt mode. Yes, yes. Uh, or their, not their robot mode, basically, because mm -hmm. I have uh, a truck, a jet, and a pterodactyl right <laughs> you've got two motorcycles and um el camino I, it's some sort of a utility truck i don't know okay cup is a man of many talents all right so how do we start uh we have our battle cards mm -hmm. we start by well we start by taking turn we, we have to decide on a turn okay okay rock paper scissors Rock paper scissors. No. on three all right one two three boom all right all right so you got we, me how we start all right so, because your first turn, mm -hmm. you can't do any with your battle cards. Now, this doesn't go by round. This goes by turn, correct? Um, this this rule that you're about to describe. This goes by turn, yes. Okay. Both of us, for setup, we draw our three cards. So, three, three battle cards. cards. The first three on our deck. This is our hand. Yes. All right? Okay. Um, since your turn is first, you can't play any battle cards. No actions. No upgrades. Okay. So, you go with the... You go with the pick an alt... And or I'm sorry, pick a pick a bot that you want to switch to an alt mode if you even want to do that. Mm -hmm. I've 
I read that that's completely optional. And uh, afterwards, you attack. Okay, and... Because all of these guys have some terminology, mm -hmm. uh, we'll get into it eventually. And, like, most of the cards, aside from Cup, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> has some kind of boost if you flip them or use them in attack mode or whatever. It depends on the on the character. I think most of those details will be sorted through play, but yeah. Cup is the way he is because he has a crazy-ass attack, uh, attack rating in bot mode. Uh, mm. Let's see. I'm going to flip Swoop. Mm -hmm. So he's in his robot mode. All right. Uh, but I don't need to attack with him, right? No, you don't need to attack with right. the same character okay. that you flip. All right, I'm going to look and see what I got first. I can't play any of them right now. Mm -hmm. I'm just looking to see what I have. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see. Your three characters. Cup has a health of eight. Flame War has a uh, health of ten. Mm -hmm. And RC has a health of nine. Correct. So what I need to do is try to drive that down to zero. Mm -hmm. Uh, let's see, who? And as it is in many things, it's always going to be attack versus defense rating. Yes, it would. Uh, you know mm -hmm. what? I am going to attack with Starscream. Okay. Uh, let's see. So he gets in, what, um, what's that called? We tap? Tap. Okay, yep. so you got to tap the character. Mm -hmm. Now, and... the note, is that because this is the first attack from any of us, uh -huh. all of my characters are quite clearly untapped. So you can have your pick of a target at that point. Okay. Now, once a character is tapped, I attack you, then you can only attack each other's tapped characters. Okay. Right. Yeah. I always I forget like what the order is between attacking and mm -hmm. defending and everything. So Starscream is going to attack. He does have a bonus saying, uh, flip one more battle card when attacking. Mm -hmm. Now, can I still do that on my opening turn? Yeah, okay. it's still an attack. It's an attack phase move. So, yeah. Okay. So I'm going to have Starscream. Uh, who should I go after? Let's let's go after Flame War. Mm -hmm. So he's got an attack power of five, plus I get to flip one extra card. Mm -hmm. Now, when you're attacking, you need to flip two mm -hmm. cards. And there's a first one. That's an, uh, And you want to look for these orange tabs. The pips up there. Yep. Right. That would, for the attacking position, because then these cards also get used as battles, mm -hmm. uh, boosters or whatever. Yeah. Which, wow, this one would be really handy if I had it as a booster, because yeah. it has a plus four to attack. It's That's that's a killer booster, but it's also a one and done. Yes, that's true. Yeah. Yeah, some <clears> of these <throat> cards are a little... Um, uh, that was what I, how I was able to win one mm -hmm. time yeah, the yeah. last time because I thought, well, it doesn't say scrap it, so I'm just going to keep playing it. Yeah. Nah. So I got to flip two battle cards, cool. if, and I'm looking for these orange pips. Sometimes yeah. it's one, sometimes it's two. Mm -hmm. Here's my second one, and it's another attack. It's another orange, and I think your camera just shut it off. It did just shut off. Why did it do that? Oh, boogers. Okay. It's possessed by a punctual ghost. All right. <laughs> so then I'm going to play my second card. It is also an orange. That is mm -hmm. an extra attack. Yep. And then since uh, I flip one more battle card when attacking, yep. here is my third. And this is a white. <laughs> you bitch. All right, that still applies <laughs> that's in still this situation. That still applies. All right, so when you flip a white, uh -huh. you're able to flip two more cards. Battle cards, right. But you can only do that once per flip. So yes. if you flip another white, then it's like... Then it's, that's one of the two cards. Yeah, then... All right, so after that, we have <clears throat> one blue and one nothing. So <sighs> I have an attack power of five, six, seven against Flame War. Right. Now, because I'm defending, I can't really do any battle cards. Uh, so what we're going to do with uh, Flame War... Um, she would get bold if she had just flipped to that, but she's just, she's just there right now, so... Um, that's a big old nope. Nothing there. But. Oh, and that's a white. Yep. Excuse me. Thankfully, I can like, pull out another, and then. Yeah, nothing there, and one defense. <laughs> one defense. Okay. All right, so that's five. What was her defense to begin with? <clears throat> her defense to begin with was one, so that's just another. I take five on that one. Uh, let's see, five, six, seven against your two. Against yes. my two, so that's, I take five. That's a damage of five. And I just realized that I did not bring my counters with me oh, tonight. Well, so, guess what? Uh, we got chips. All right, give me them chips. There's a f red is the five. Boom. All right. 
Yay me. Sorry, Flame War. I didn't mean to do this to you in the first turn. <laughs> all right, I am going to... Oh, these all go in your scrap pile? Yep. That's, I'm going to make that my scrap pile. Yeah. Oh. So I don't get them confused. Mm-hmm. And I'm going to call it at that. Actually, let me just go ahead and throw those there. Oh, yeah, you got a holder. I'm fancy. All right, so... Oh, we didn't point this out. Hmm. Your deck, that your draw deck, can only have a limit of 40 cards. That's right, 40 cards and uh, three copies of any one type of battle card. Oh, I didn't know that. Uh, I do not have more than three cards. Oh, so I was going to say, did you load up on grenade launchers? <laughs> Cause, That'd be funny. Because you piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> um, all right, so second turn. Now here's where things get interesting. I can play one card, one battle card. Um, sorry. <laughs> I can play one battle card uh, because of the, that weird limitation thing. That's... That's still like a. I have I have a couple of questions about how the game's balanced because of that because that's really weird and inconsistent. But whatever, it also makes for a better game. Um, and at the moment, I want to see what we've got for uh, mode changes. All right. Uh, oh, you flipped Flame War. I flipped Flame War. Okay. <sighs> Damn, I should have flipped Cup like right away. But right. well, you haven't done anything, so you still could, right? Or is there a limit to the amount of oh, cards you can only, flip? Only one flip. Only one uh, flip. Unless, a, unless you have a card that states otherwise. But okay. yeah, typically it's just one mode flip. Oh. And, all right, so I went on the first turn. You're going mm -hmm. on the second turn. What are your limitations as far as battle cards right I can right only now? play one battle card. You can play one. Either an action or an upgrade. Okay. I'm going to play this as an action so I can get, you know, super loaded up. All right, inspiring leadership, mm -hmm. draw three cards, and then scrap two from your hand. Yes. I have a couple of those. That can come in handy if you draw something really weak. Mm-hmm. Um, and they go in your scrap pile, too. Okay. There are some cards that say take something out of your hand and put it on the top of your draw pile. Yeah. Which is really good, because that way, like, I got this attack, I'm going to put you there, and that way I know I am could use you right away. I'm going to keep this one because this is a crazy good card, even though it's not going to be very situational for me right now. All right. That one gets scrapped. All right. So, uh, starting with whoever's got the moxie. Um, you got the touch! Which one of these assholes does have the touch? See, if he was over on five, I'd be like going for swoop like right away. But... Mm. Um, I want to leave Flame War open. So RC is going to go after Swoopy Shroop. Um, and I got no buffs for anybody. So it's going to be a pretty weak ass salvo. Okay. I'm sorry. She has to go after Starscream, doesn't she? Doesn't have to. Well, she does because that's your tapped character. Oh. Remember? Yeah. Oh, that's right. Uh, yeah, okay. I'll start with her. All right. Um,. Here's your first draw. That's, oh, that's one attack. That's good news. That's two attacks. That's pretty and damn good news. What's her attack level? At a base of two, so she's got four attacks. So four attack against my one, one defense. defense, so I All need right. a draw for defense. Pull them Ds. All right, that's an attack that does nothing. That's an attack that does nothing. All right, and so, that's nothing. So I have a defense of one against your attack, attack of, of four. four. So that is a damage of three. Three damage on me. And you'll notice this big boy is a damage sponge. Yes, he's so, got lots of health. So he's at, he was at a health of fourteen, and I'm mm -hmm. using these poker chips yeah. as markers. Uh, white equals one, so he is down to eleven. I think I have an idea for what we can send people that accept Cretan skill challenges. Something a little juicier for them to, you know, put in that extra bit of effort. Oh, aside so, from the aside the from glasses that. and the the new stickers I'm sending out. Mm -hmm. You got the sticker designs up? I get, I did get them. All right, all right, cool. That's great and all. Matter of fact, uh, I forgot. Mm -hmm. This is yours because you're a two. Actually, yeah, you're a two-time champion. Oh no, it's just <laughs> I could just use these as like. Yeah, you, you get <laughs> two stickers. Oh, cool. These will go right on my trunk then. Yeah, these are uh, little hologram stickers of the Cretan Built you know, Championship. It's like it's like speaking of trading uh, trading card premiums and stuff. When everything used to look like this, yeah, like the old marble trading cards. These you'll notice have like a like a. Like a laser emboss uh, yeah. sheen to them also, which is kind of cool. Some of them have like a, a glossy finish. And mm -hmm. actually, I've noticed the 
alt mode, mm -hmm. not a whole lot. Flip over to the robot the mode, shiny. Yeah, the character <laughs> sides have uh, have all the moxie on them. Yeah. All right. Um, so, are you still going for this round? Um, no, no, I can't because all of your characters aren't tapped. Okay. Remember, that's the kind. Oh, you can only attack one if tapped they're character. All tapped, and you've got at least one untapped character left. So can I, I can't start. I can't start piling onto one character. Oh, okay. Because you'd be out and around. Well, I mean, that's a, the price you pay, but... Yeah, yeah, there's only so many, like, counters you can draw up, though. Okay. Yeah. It's, like, mathematically speaking, uh, it would be too easy to, to, to just turn around, uh, turn around over like that, which is why they go one-to-one-to-one, -to -one -to -one, unless you've got, like, all your characters are untapped. But mathematically speaking, it's not going to be probable, probable that I would have, like, three untapped characters when you have, like, all t untapped characters. Okay. Or something like that. All right. So, so here we are at turn three. Mm-hmm. Which I guess this is where the real gameplay can start. Yep. All right. Flip, so attack, upgrade, kick ass. All right. So first off, you draw battle card. Mm -hmm. uh, let me compare what I have. All right. That's going to come in handy later. Oh yeah, and realizing now that our decks were only supposed to be about this size, like a forty card deck. Yeah. Is about we, that wide. We were, I was using about sixty five the last two I think times. I was using like eighty <laughs> <laughs> in the last in the last um, in the last round we had. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to flip Optimus to his mm -hmm. robot mode, okay. which uh, flip one more battle card when attacking. Mm -hmm. So, And I'm also going to add on a upgrade weapon that does two plus damage. God damn. All right. And let's see. I'm, we're going to stay on Flame War. Mm -hmm. uh, Don't have any see. actions to play also, right? Just going to stick with the one upgrade. I'm going to stick with that for the moment. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah, because there's one I'm going to save for later. Oh, god damn it. Yes. <laughs> I smell right. drill arms. All right, so attacking. Mm -hmm. Right now I'm at a battle uh, attack level of five with the weapon upgrade. Mm -hmm. uh, but my attacks are going to be, that's a blue, that's nothing. That is a white, so draw two more. And you're coming after RC, right? I'm coming after Flame War. Oh, I have to come after RC because she is... Because she's tapped. Tapped, yeah. Okay. All right. I mean, be sure to tap your guys, too, before they start attacking. Oh, okay. Yeah. And there we go. There we go. All right. All right. All right, so two more, because I drew a white. That's mm -hmm. one attack. Mm -hmm. And a double blue, but I'm not defending. All right, so that is attack level of three, five, six against RC. <laughs> against the defensive one. A defensive one. Let's see here. I'm not going to have any defense-activated uh, uh, battle cards, because I don't know have any of the uh, other waves with me, but there's a blue, so that's a good start. All right. Oh, fuck. <laughs> so that's uh, two defense, and you pulled up uh, Three, four, five, six. Six. Ooh. Ooh. How much damage is that? That's four. That's a four. <laughs> All right. That's uh, four. Horrible. All right. <laughs> well... All right, I need to scrap these. I'm already getting my ass beat pretty roundly here. Mm -hmm. Now, an upgrade weapon, that stays on the character? That does stay. All yes. right. Unless gonna... it's stated otherwise, like the grenade launcher. Okay, we are going to keep that there. All right. And uh, I'm going to stay as is. All right. So, I am in... I'm in attack. So, I'm going to draw up. I got one card here. And now we can do actions and upgrades. You're gonna get all, you're gonna get moted, but I can only attack with these two. So, what you could use is a primary laser. A, uh, as an action, I am going to. Hmm. Keep that right there. Actually, I'm gonna play that action. Scrap the top four cards of your deck. Put all upgrades scrap this way into your hand. Whoa. Top four cards? That's a good fucking card. <laughs> if you got a bunch of trash, yeah. Yeah. So, uh... Upgrades. Oh, is that from previous play? No, this is the one I just played. Oh, okay. This is my action. Sorry. Yes, Here's yes. my upgrade. There's my action. This is my rifle. This is my gun. This is for fighting. This is for having fun! <laughs> this is for lonely nights. <laughs> You call her Lucille. <laughs> There's a... 
there's a there's a cognitive discrepancy there. I'm willing to say, but uh, <laughs> as far as like uh, gender identifiers go, but hey, f- uh, fly your freak flag as high as you doing? can. What I'd like to doubt is uh, Flame War, mm-hmm. and um, he's five in that mode, but with little defense. Unfortunately, he's a, he's just a fucking damaged sponge, as was pointed out earlier. Um, oh, Starscream. Yeah, Starscream, you little shit. However, bold on a uh, bold on the defensive two for Optimus. Fucking just spreading damage around at this point. Uh, Flame War's going after Starscream. All right. Um, yes. All right. So, and naturally, uh, she's got uh, attack of five here. Upgrade. You're in attack of three and upgrade of an uh, upgrade of two uh, versus your d- defense of one. And so here we go. Uh, that's a that's a fantastic start right there. <laughs> oh, nothing. Killer. Oh my god, why? <laughs> yeah, there are some cards that have no uh, color uh, clips on them at all. Oh, that sucks out loud. Alright, five versus whatever you're pulling. Uh let's see, I have a that doesn't help me with an orange and a double orange. <sighs> Nothing oh, there. All right. Balls on balls. So I take, take how much damage? That's five. With a defense of one, you take four. Four damage total. Yeah. All right. So let's see. Thank you, shitty Here's defensive four. Flip. Turn that in. And I've got, uh, let's see, five, six, seven with seven. I have seven health left. Mm-hmm. Here's where I'm beginning to realize that star rating should really have been uh, heated. With with you having a team of three, and if you want to attack this next round, which I think you have to attack anyway, yeah. you're going to be tapping that swoop. And if I had four, even if like just all C carters, mm-hmm. I would still have at least two people to attack any of your cards with uh. after you tapped out. Some bitch. Mm. But not tonight. <laughs> What you gonna do? Are you all good? I am good. All right, so I'm gonna draw my first card here. All right, so what I'm gonna do? Mm-hmm. Uh, let's see. I can only attack with Swoop, mm-hmm. who's got an attack of five, defense of zero. Yeah, he's nasty. Yeah, uh, he's weak, but he's nasty. Eh, he's he's a good soldier. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna put an action on him. Mm-hmm. Uh, use your character. Or one, one of your characters gets plus three attack until end of turn. God damn! Really? <laughs> the funny thing is that's a defensive card as well. Mm-hmm. So I don't know how that works, but okay. So with an attack of five, with a three boost, mm-hmm. he has an attack of eight mm-hmm. on top of whatever I'm about to pull, which that's a double blue, nothing, and a blue. So, okay, so all right. So that came, that came in handy this turn. Yep. So that is attack of eight versus whatever you draw. Okay, who are you going after? I can only go after RC or Flame War. Okay, then Flame War. Okay. Typically, you would, we announce those before the attack. You're right. right. I forgot. Um, but so you're going after Flame War. Nice thing about her is that uh, I flipped her to this mode because she gets a natural tough, and not only does she get a natural tough, so do my other teammates. So that's a tough one. I can draw an extra card for defense. Oh, okay. And I, I've got to mention that if you're watching in like the the, the corner and the uh, the tight camera, it keeps shutting itself off. I don't mm-hmm. know why, mm-hmm. but that's why. You, if it just goes away, that's why. So I'm sorry about that. This technology's trying to fuck. I us. don't know why it shuts itself off. If I wanted to record, why won't you just fucking record? Decepticon spy. It, you haven't vetted this guy, have you? What was that one? Transformer that was like three robots and it turned into a real working Fucking camera. Reflector. Reflector. Oh my god. That's Reflector's was, grandkid. Reflector was the tits times three. I love that guy. Have you seen like the uh, the Siege model of the Reflector that came out uh, this year? Or last year? I'll look it up. <laughs> it's fucking awesome. Alright, so I pull, I pull the white. I'm going to go ahead and resolve this tough one first. Okay. So that's my third card. And then two more for the white. Two uh, more? Yeah. Oh, that's right. That's right. Okay, that's another and... orange and another orange. Hey, wow. Zeus, now that is a shit pull. Whew. 
<laughs> that is terrible. It's five cards with only one helping you. So, uh -huh. all, right. all right. So, again, that is my attack of eight versus your defense, defense of, of two. two. Flame War is not long for this world. Um, and that puts another eight to six on her? Wait. Six? Yeah. She's dead. She's out. She's out. She's, fuck you. Ugh. All right. Well, don't get her passive mode bonus anymore. And you know why I targeted her more than anything? Huh. I couldn't even see what it says on her terminology, but mm -hmm. I saw, all right, that's a lot of texture on there. Yeah. Let's get rid of this guy. <laughs> yeah, the more text it has, the, yeah. the more of a threat it is. <laughs> Each of your character has tough one. Mm -hmm. Flip one more battle card when defending. Yeah, I'm yeah. glad I got rid of that. <laughs> yeah. Well, now everybody else on my team's kind of minced meat. All right. Um, well, that leaves me with uh, with... One cup, one girl, one cup. <laughs> Doesn't seem like as much of a party anymore. Oh. Ah! Ah! Drop my bat. Party foul! Oh. Okay. This is how disappointed everyone is. All the cards want to leave. All right. Uh, let me drop one. <laughs> All right. Um... I'm so glad I drew this. Put those. Oh wait, 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 wait. Uh, where was the two? I need one, uh, one ship, one ship. What for? Uh, for for flame war. It's coming back from the dead. Oh, um, with just one damage. What is this? It's Holy a, fuck! It's a good fucking. Return card. one of your KO characters that has twelve plus stars or fewer. How many stars does she have? Twelve or fewer to the battlefield. She has yep. five. And repair one damage from it. Yep. Wait, does that mean instead of 10, she has um, one? She only has one damage on her, right. No, 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 no. Not one uh, one damage, one health. Mm -hmm. And repair one damage from it mm -hmm. at end at, of turn. End of turn, KO it. Right. I, I read that as in she comes back with nine damage on her because she had one one repair. Yeah. Or am oh, I wrong? I'm sorry. Uh, then yeah, she would have like a ton of damage on her. But oh, okay. But still, yeah. that's a nice card to have, especially when no kidding. their passive alt mode uh, grants you uh, a bolt for any attack. Now, wow. She just came back from the dead. I haven't picked an alt yet, so cup. <laughs> He's going for it. So you get scrapped, obviously. Uh, and I haven't done an upgrade on anyone yet. And I think maybe now we're going to be getting an upgrade. Interesting. Because we could actually go for Prime. Okay. All right. Uh, upgrade on this guy. When the upgraded character is attacking, it has Pierce that attack for each blue. Flip, flip, flip. Do at least one damage when attacking, but not more than whatever is attack total. So I stand a chance of completely negating his defense, but he also gets a plus one to that five. Oh, wow. So, cup. All right. He's going for prime. All right. Okay. Let's see what you got. <laughs> That's, That's a good start. Fuck me. That's a good start. That's a white. Yeah. I mean, it's still a negation of an attack pip, but still... Uh, that's see. another white, but that does not count as a double flip, right? Does not count. And that's simply one more attack for me. So unfortunately, uh, I don't get like all that piercing damage for because no blues. But that's still an attack of seven. All right, so just so I understand, this white allows you to draw two more cards, and that's what these two were, right? Shit, so right. you have one more draw to go? I have one more draw to go, thank you. I'm boning myself here. <laughs> kind of. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So that's another attack. Yep. All right. So, all right. What do we have as an attack? All right. Five, six, seven, and eight. Whew. Against yep. my two. So hopefully I draw something nice. Your attack is still your uh, your defense is still good though. There's no piercing all damage right. drawn. All right. That's an orange that does nothing, mm -hmm. and that's an orange it does nothing. Oh shite. So the goggles. Goggles. They did nothing. All right. Uh, that's you taken. That's two defense. With an attack of eight, six, seven, eight. That's a lot. That's a six damage on me. <sighs> Thank you, Flamewar. You can die now. You know what? We were we were talking about this last time. Mm -hmm. Why is it 
characters like Soundwave and Optimus mm-hmm. have a cover over their mouth, but we can hear them perfectly. <laughs> For the most part, <laughs> well, that's Optimus mostly. Well, Soundwave, Soundwave sounds like you, how you'd expect. <laughs> <laughs> he has he has no phonemes and he can't articulate speech, so it's just like. <laughs> <laughs> But, uh, but Optimus, um, who's the other one? Um, Sun, not Sunstreaker. Um, Jazz. He j- he just got like the screen across his face. Ugh, not Jazz. It's the guy that I'm forgetting. He's he's like a Formula One racer, I believe. Oh, but he's he also has those two weird like not ears. I thought that was Jazz. <laughs> I, no, Jazz is um Jazz is uh Jazz is the Nissan where he's got like that huge. He's got some big old boobies. <laughs> Bringing that back around to the a headlight conversation, yeah, but he still has a face because he was like one of the ones that I liked. He has the, he has the sunglasses though, so I don't know if that actually like, I don't know what, uh, what, what function that would necessitate. Like uh, he's not photosensitive or anything. Mm-hmm. I don't know if any of the transformers are. No, you think Perceptor would probably be if anyone. Yeah, really. <laughs> <laughs> or Reflector, since or Reflector, his, yeah, his his, uh, fun- his technology is based upon uh, photos uh, photosensitivity. Oh my God. But but here's the thing. Um, do you remember at the end, uh, you take, and you took your damage? Yes, okay. that's what that is. You remember at the end of uh, Transformers the movie, by the way, spoilers incoming, um, when everybody's just like thrashing the shit out of Unicron mm-hmm. and like popping him in the eye. Yeah. Like somebody threw another robot into his right eye and he's just like, because <laughs> it was Wonderful Orson, Orson Welles. Because it was Orson Welles. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was a... <laughs> You couldn't even tell it was me impersonating. No, I thought I thought you reincarnated and he was sitting right there. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> and they're fighting like inside of his head. Yeah. And then somebody like flies out through his other eye. Yeah, Galvatron. Right. There's nothing behind them. There's no cones or rods or anything. No, no. like uh, I know like um I would assume functioning equipment or anything. So what do they not even really see? Do they not perceive visuals? We're getting into transformer biology. That see, I we're really doing can't we're explain. doing the thing again that we were doing earlier. Yeah. Doing shit. All right. All right. Uh, so all five characters on the board have been tapped. Tapped. Now, so now everybody untapped gets untapped, but the damage still remains. The upgrades still remain. But the damage still remains! That was also Orson Welles. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, nope, I tapped him the wrong way. Okay. Alright, so fresh start. Here we go, new round. All I'm right. going to draw my battle card. Uh, let's see, What? how much damage you got here? Four, Four on her, she's nine, she has five left. She's got five left. Okay. Yes. Everything um, is awful. Alright, so I... Could play an upgrade and an, an action. Action and an upgrade. Yep. Action and an upgrade. Mm-hmm. Uh, so I am going to play an action uh, that grants two extra damage to RC. To any enemy. All right. Give me that shits. That's <clears throat> two more. Mm-hmm. And then that gets scrapped. And then uh, I'm going to put this weapon upgrade on Swoop. Mm-hmm. Oh, you're you're scrapping the other one. Uh, well, one's a weapon and one's an action. Oh well. Oh, I was supposed to scrap this earlier. Right. Okay, <laughs> but it never came into play. Okay, good, good, good. Uh, so yes, so yeah, uh, that that guy was supposed to be gone, but it never really helped me or hurt okay. me or anything. Ooh, that's a good upgrade too. Uh, flip one more battle card when attacking. So Swoop is going to attack RC. Mm-hmm. Uh, right now. Saw that coming. So I can draw up to three battle cards. Uh, that's a blue. Does mm-hmm. nothing. That is a orange. That's a plus one attack. And that is another orange plus two. Mm-hmm. So one, two with a battle attack of five. That's a total of seven attack on RC. All right. <sighs> I don't think she's going to make it through this one, but let's see what we can do. I guess I should have put that card on. Oh, well. Okay. That's a white. That's so a you white. get to draw two more. That's an orange, There's which a is useless battle in orange. this situation. <laughs> That's nice. Oh, a double blue. Yeah, but I, wow. I better draw like 
So right. you have one more draw to go. Yeah, I better draw like four of them, but no, that's not going to happen. So that's uh, two defense on top of my natural one, and you drew how one, much? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, well, she's um, she's dead. <laughs> God damn it. All right. Later, girls. So who we got left? Good old Sergeant Cup. Let's see what he can do now. <laughs> and this uh, this upgrade weapon, that stays on. That stays on him, yeah. All right. He is tapped, though. He is tapped. Yep, he's tapped that swoop. Oh, you can have those back. Because RC sure as fuck don't need them. <laughs> All right. Um, God, I'm going to have to go for the friggin' jugular here. You can play this action... And my upgrade sticks, so I'm keeping that upgrade. One of your kids scrap these, Yee. just so they don't get involved. Yes, you're always, you're always supposed to scrap them anyway because of your battle cards. Sometimes actions involve pulling uh, from scrap piles. Um, leap into you know what I never read or never made sure of. What if our scrap piles are face up or face down? I've been putting mine face up just so I distinguish them from the yeah. the ones from my draw pile. No, typically and discards are face up anyway. I mean, we're probably doing it correctly, but I wonder if that. Uh, uh, hmm. Well, last time we played, I had to go back to my scrap pile, uh -huh. and when I did, I just picked them up and I just shuffled them. Yeah, you have to do that when you draw down to your when you draw down your uh, battle pile anyway, um, or your deck. Oh, sorry, battle pile. <laughs> <laughs> I just left a massive battle pile in there. I'd wait a few minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Lard a carburetor. Ugh, a couple of matches might do you some good. All right. Um, Cup is uh, leaving the battle. So he's got an extra three attack until the end of the turn. Wow. So on top of on your... On top of this and on top of a pretty generous attack rating to begin with. All right. Cup is meaning some business. Uh, Cup wants to do a little bit of trash in here. So right. um, he's going to go after... That's a, well, Swoop's your only one open right now, right? He's the only one that's, uh, f uh, not flipped, uh, tapped. tapped. yeah. Uh, with a defense rating of zero. Correct. Cup might get a little bit of a kick out of this. All right. I'm, a, I'm not speaking for him, but I know this guy. He's uh, crazy. Let's see how your draw has been going. Uh, War's done some crazy shit to him. So, the upgraded character is attacking has Pierce 1 for each. So, we're just going to do... This that's... reminds me of the Battle of Moonbase 3. Nobody cares, Cup. Your war, your war stories are twisted. Tell Grimlock about the petrol rabbits. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what did you draw? You drew a orange, orange and, a and a yellow white. or a white. Yep. Excuse me. So I can draw two more. Two more, a blue. Yeah, but that equals piercing. Well, it doesn't count for him anyway, unless you draw a couple of blues. In which case, another blue. Let's see. Let's see what happens. All right. So, what is your attack then? My attack is five. Six, seven, eight, nine. Holy shit. Ten. All right. Ooh. All right. And whatever blues you draw, those stand a chance of negating them because of thermal weaponry. All right. Uh, wow. You can right. just kill them right now. I mean, well, I mean, I could unless I really <laughs> draw some great stuff. Mm hmm. Uh, Swoop's damage is, uh, his health is a ten. You could draw two handheld blasters in a row. Well, it went, I'm only going for the color. Variant, right? Nothing else really matters. Nothing else really matters. Yeah, I'm just saying two blue pips on that one would be very nice for you yeah. right now. Uh, that's a one. That's one. And that's a two. That's two. But you know what? Negate. Negate. Right. So you are taking five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten in damage. Swoop is out. I Man, wow. That's crazy. I like Cup now. <laughs> you wonder, Well, you had like a hundred boosts on him. Yes, I did. You know why I like using Swoop? Huh. Because when he's in robot mode and then you flip him over, mm -hmm. when you flip to this mode, move one damage from Swoop to an enemy. Yeah. Uh, and I didn't even get to use that because I was waiting for you to attack him. Mm -hmm. And when you finally did, you wipe him off with one hit. You remember when I... Uh Swapped or uh, switched to uh, Sergeant uh, Sergeant Cup's alt mode instead of uh, RC's. That was a hard ass decision because her alt. I was uh, counting on uh, using that to heal uh, the other the other two characters. Oh, so that would have been. Nice I didn't know to that. Have. And it, it always helps if you know what your uh, your opponent is uh, using. 
I think you're. It's okay. Like it's not considered taboo to ask it, uh, before the game starts. Can I see what you're using? Well, no. See what I mean, they're clearly are. visible anyway. Yeah. Well, I mean, you no. I mean, what's underneath in the robot mode? You're starting in the alt mode. Still, uh, if the if the cards are out, that means they're meant to be seen. All as right. far as are those yours? In or mine? my opinion, um, those are yours. Those are mine. Right? Yeah. Okay. And I'm about down to my last. I'm the getting kind of thin, too. too. Oh, you drew a lot of whites, though. That's uh -huh. that's why you're down. All right, so let me draw mine here. I drew a lot of whites. All right, I am going to play this action <laughs> card of draw three, then scrap two uh -huh. from my hand. So basically it's draw from your pile and keep the keep one that you'll really like. Mm -hmm. um, all right, so what am I going to Back to our regular use? scheduled programming. Yeah. Already in progress. Man, I got two really good ones. Which one should I use? Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to... Uh, let me check something real quick. Yeah, Starscream... Um, I'm going to flip him mm -hmm. into his bot mode. Okay. It gives him a plus one on defense opposed to a zero. Mm -hmm. Which would be nice. Because uh, apparently Cut likes putting the hurting on people. Yeah. Yeah. I'd be, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm going to shuffle these okay, while Lupin. you're doing that thing. <laughs> Balls. <laughs> All right, I I, I can think, scrap a weapon and put a new weapon on, right? I think my Orson Welles was better. Um, <laughs> yeah, you can do that. Okay, I'm going to do that. I'm going to scrap this primary laser, which was nice with the plus two attack. Mm -hmm. But I'm going to put a grenade launcher on Optimus. <laughs> Why? <laughs> which is a plus four damage. No. <sighs> All right. And I'm going to tap Optimus and obviously attack cup mm -hmm. uh optimus <laughs> has a plus or a bold one flip one more battle card when attacking where did you leave your attack cup <laughs> in my locker all right so here's one attack that's a blank card that's nothing here's mm -hmm. my second second attack which mm -hmm. is a white card so i draw two one Two. Whoa! That, the first one was a white, means nothing. What? This one is a double orange. What a saving flip. And then... God damn. My plus one with Optimus <clears throat> is another attack. Ooh. So that is a three, mm -hmm. seven, eight, nine, ten attack on uh, Cup. Uh, all right. Well, Who's got a health of eight. A health of eight and a, and a natural defense of one. I could pull out of this. Let's see. Yeah. Damn good start. All right. A white is a good start. Uh, there's one blue. Okay. Oh, these are all upside down now. That's two blues. Oh, that infuriates me. <laughs> all right. So now the bonus or your extra. That's two blues and a defense of three. Your attack remind me? Uh, let's count again. Three, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten, uh, there's a three to, oh my god, uh, ten out of three, seven, I have one, I have one health left. Uh, let's see, so, damage of seven, yes. He still functions. He still. <laughs> Cup still functions. Thank the Matrix, I'm still kicking. I don't know how. <laughs> Oh, the Matrix had nothing to do with it, Cup. <laughs> it's your stubborn ass refusing to die. <laughs> <clears throat> Which means he's not any terrestrial utility uh, uh, utility uh, coop that I know of, because most of them are kind of trash. <laughs> <laughs> All right, this is your go. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Um, man, he, he's on his last legs, but playing my cards right, I could totally make a decent go at taking out Optimus. Let's see what you do. Let's see what you get. Um, terrible for actions. That's now, if you pull off another, like, massive cup dick flop, <laughs> you, you could go after Starscream. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
He has seven <laughs> left. It's, you mean if I fill the cup? Yeah, if you fill the cup. He filled the cup. I, filled the cup. <laughs> <laughs> I just filled the cup. Well, that's a good start right there. So, uh, Who do, are you going after? One damage to Optimus, because he's the only one that stabs. Okay. Um, Is that like right off the bat? <clears throat> one damage? Yeah, right off the oh. bat. All right. I had a couple of cards that take advantage of the ranged keyword, too. Shit, 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 shit. So, <clears throat> it's an extra one for him. Um, I got nothing to upgrade. Where'd I put my fucking cards at? Oh, my God. You were shuffling them. No, I put them over here because I'm an oh. asshole. Ugh. All right. <clears throat> nothing else I want to play because I like my upgrade here. Um, defensive 2 on Optimus. I'm going to go ahead and uh, pull. It's a... Pull it. Base damage of five. Upgraded one. Already dodging one of your uh, defenses. Pierce of one. And that's an attack of one. So, go ahead and go. <sighs> Too bad I didn't pull any whites on that. That would have been great. All right. <clears throat> so, uh, I have nothing uh, bonus defensive-wise. Mm -hmm. So, my first draw is a blue. Huh. Second draw is a double orange. Nothing. So I have a defense of three against your attack of... Uh, that would be a six. Optimus is dead. Well, also, that was uh, he pierced one damage, or one uh, armor anyway. So yeah, and I, already, I took care of that right, yeah. right off the bat. Oh, that's... When, when you pierce an armor, you don't actually take damage for that. It just negates oh. defense. Well, you still did so much damage that you... That Optimus is yeah, done. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A cup is a clowning machine, apparently. Optimus only has a health of 10. That's so... I find that a little bizarre, but yeah. there we go. Well, he's got he's got very good uh, passive support abilities, though, right? <laughs> and as a leader, you want to be able to support your team. 27 times. Yeah, 27 times. 27 times Optimus has died. He's a team player. What can you say? <laughs> Through all video game and TV show and comics, he's died 27 fucking times. Starscream has died 22 <laughs> I think he should have died a few more. Speaking of which, that's who I all I have left. Yeah, and honestly, uh, I don't see Cup <laughs> really rallying against this one. So do what you can. How much damage does he have uh, on on his current mode? He's on no five. Cup. Oh, he's he's just about fucking dead. What, what has he got left? Uh, one. He's got one left. Yeah. No, five, six, seven. Yeah, he's got one left. So all I've got to do is hit you. Yes. All right. So let's. Draw Starscream sneezes, cup dies. <laughs> <laughs> Take out the old one! But hey, he brought down as many of you motherfuckers as he possibly could oh my God. catching well, it. He took out Swoop with one hit. Yeah, respect the cup. Alright, uh, let's see. He doesn't have a bonus or anything on him, mm -hmm. so what I'm going to do is go for broke. I'm going to flip Starscream to his alt mode, which gives him a stronger... Attack. Mm -hmm. uh, all right. Now, I was uh, trying to see what you were going for uh, with a five attack. Oh, that's right. I wanted to see what his alt was. His alt's not much different stat-wise. Uh, no, it's the terminology down here that mm. really, really helps him. So that is why I'm going to upgrade his weapon to mm -hmm. a piercing blaster, mm. which is a pierce three, mm -hmm. do at least three damage when attacking, but not more than the... Attacking total, right? Pierce number add together. So what that would mean is if I had three defense, the three defense wouldn't last anymore. But I only have one, so that just erases the one defense. Doesn't and really. It doesn't damage. It, doesn't it just damage negates it. up to three of okay. defense. All right. All right. So now attacking. <sighs> Roll that beautiful. Oh, plus Starscream gets a bonus Next. draw when it comes to attacking for, for bold one. That's right. one oh, orange crap. That's a double blue, and his bonus huh. is a white. Oh, no. In this case, I still draw two. Yeah, you do. All right. So we have an orange-blue <laughs> and another orange. <laughs> okay, so five, six, seven, eight. I'd have to draw it. Nah, he's dead. And this... <laughs> he's fucking dead. <laughs> That's it. You're yeah, not even going to count it, huh? No, he's, he's gone. <laughs> all right. I'd have to... No, it, if, if there was any... All right, all right. Just, just to satisfy our curiosity. Sure. That's an orange. That's a white. That's an orange. One more. And Cup's still dead. <laughs> so, yeah. 
Not much was going to happen there. All right, so are you a fan of this game now? If you are, let us know. If we did something wrong, please, for the love of God, let us know. Shit, I've been liking this crap since before I uh, actually knew how to play it. <laughs> yeah, this is, uh, you know, if you're a Transformers fan, this game is a yeah. lot of fun. Yeah, uh, and I'm still liking it, even though I don't yet know how to play it correctly. So, well, you it's all right. <laughs> <laughs> the luck of the draw is a major, major factor. Yeah. Well, we got the rules down well enough, but I'm sitting here, like, coming up with gag teams and shit when I should be taking it seriously. <laughs> hey, I'll tell you what, though. I'm gonna... I should give you a bonus point every round just for do the, the characters you drew. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Many people might not share those sentiments, uh, but hey, this is the Cretans Guild. And, yeah, uh, we, we, if, we if we can stay Cretans classless, we will do it yeah, every exactly. single Exactly, yes. I'm gonna start rethinking the uh, cup in other hands, though. That was a uh, that was a bit of an eye opener. All right. So that was Transformers. Did you like it? Did you not like it? We loved was it. Was it more than meets the eye? Ooh, oh, that's a good tag. That's really mm -hmm. good. I'm gonna, I might use that. Yeah. So guys, go ahead subscribe uh, to this particular channel. This is the Cretans Guild YouTube channel. Or if you're just still listening to us on the podcast, hey, go ahead rate and review us. That would be. Uh, you know, big help to us. And, you know, we haven't mentioned the Podfix Network, mm -hmm. but we are now. Oh, yeah, we're moving on up. We're, we are part of the Podfix Network. Check out all the podcasts available on podfixnet.com. Or is it network.com? <laughs> it's one wanna, of the two. I want to get that sorted out yeah. before too long. <laughs> yeah, I guarantee it's on the description of our Twitter page. It, that's exactly where that is. Somewhere. So I, guess. I don't know. Check us out on Instagram and Twitter at Cretans Guild. Subscribe to my channel, uh, Skipper Bob's Breakdowns, mm -hmm. on YouTube, mm -hmm. or Jay's channel. Newly christened Skipper Bob's Breakdowns. Newly christened yep. by, by about a month or so. I got a big trip to Disney planned, so mm -hmm. hopefully I'll have some stuff to break down. Go ahead, review all that, uh, subscribe to all that. And tell us how, what you think of this game. You like it? You don't like it? You say piss off? I don't care. <laughs> Just tell us. So, guys, thanks very much for tuning in, whether it be on the YouTube or on the Podbean or any Is other it, of the podcast players. When you say piss off, can you have, like, a gif of Bumblebee peeing on John Turturro from the first movie? That'd be cute. Oh, I would get copyright stricken in a heartbeat. That's a gif, though. Because you can just kind of like put a little like tiny in the corner. Let's see what I can find. Hmm, maybe. Stop lubricating on the man. <laughs> that was so dumb. <laughs> what? Those movies. Oh, God. They were, <laughs> it was terrible. Yeah. Guys, thanks uh, again for watching or listening, whichever you were doing. And I'm a winner. He's a two time Green Skill mm -hmm. champion. Anyone who wins gets that and some other swag. Yes. So, guys, thanks for tuning in. Once again, I'm going to finally sign out and say, Welcome to the Guild. This was a podcast of the Podfix Network. You can check out more shows like it at podfixnetwork.com.